was satisfying, but more just like I had a lot of fun out there. And uh, it's tough not to on this team. And it was just, it was really good to, uh, I don't know, it's a loss for words and, you know, not pitching in a major league game since 2018 and the road I took, but it just makes everything worth it a little bit. And I think part of that is why I could just go out there and compete and not have the external factors of pressure, so. Does also getting all that offensive support take a load off you too? Yeah, I mean, as a starter, that's your job is just to keep the team in the game. So for me, it was, we had a lead early and it was just throw strikes and trust the defense. And, you know, if you give up run, just limit it and get the team back in the dugout and let them just swing. I, I don't know how many hits we had today, but it was a lot. And was, yeah, so for me, it's like my, my goal as a starter is just keeping my team in a position to win. You know, whatever happens in between, it happens, and if you can just keep your team in a position to win the game, that's what you're supposed to do as a starting pitcher. When you go to any ball, obviously your goal is to get back. Yeah. Um, to pull that off. Uh, I know you're going to lost for words, but um, holding on to the dream, even if it's obtaining the dream a second time, is real. Yeah, I mean, it, it takes a lot of self-belief, and for me, it was, I, I just didn't feel like I was done. And I don't know, I got caught up at 23 and, you know, it was something I never thought I could do. And I just, maybe I needed to go back to any ball to find that, you know, that inner drive in me and that determination to get me back. But it wasn't without like the people around me and, you know, any ball's any ball, but like there's a lot of guys that are doing the same thing as me, trying to get back. And like, when I see, you know, guys like Daniel Murphy doing the same thing as me. It's, it's not poor me, but it's like, hey, I'm still wearing a uniform and there's always an opportunity. No, no, well, you, you can go ahead. Yeah, so, so uh, when was uh, the... He can't get it. <laughs> go ahead. Okay, I'm glad, fitting. You, I'm glad you didn't get that out, actually. You don't even know what it is. I know. It's not gonna be good. Is it fitting that on uh, July 4th, America's team has to win on July 4th. Well, you know what? I mean, it, it was a, a great start to the game because yeah. you, you never know for sure. You know, 11 o'clock game. And, um, obviously, we've been playing hard and, you know, we had a night game last night. Both teams had to do it. But the way we came out early in that game, the base running, obviously we were getting some hits, but really the base running set yeah. the tone for the game. And, man, it was uh, – they played hard for nine innings, and that's what it took. Um, so a lot of good things happened. Where do, you, where do you want to start? Next man up has been the mentality. It was pretty much all men up today. You got contributions everywhere in the line. Yeah, and you know, before I we forget to go here, Brett Kennedy, what he did for us today was, uh, I mean, that was outstanding. He's been pitching well in AAA. Um, he hasn't been in the big leagues for a while, so... That gave us confidence for sure. And then our offense, like you said, uh, one through nine, everyone contributed. Um, guys off the bench contributed and contributed in a lot of different ways. There was good defensive plays all day. Uh, definitely the big hits and the home runs. But I, I, again, I go back to the base running, just the, especially the way it started out. Um, uh, really was uh, fun to watch. Final line for Kennedy, probably not indicative of what it meant, what he gave you today. Yeah, I didn't even think about the final line, but um, that was a win. That was a winning start. He did everything right. Um, you know, and, and when you have a lead like that, you can't pitch to try to be perfect either. And, um, you know, he loves to compete. He attacked the strike zone with uh, uh, you know his best pitches uh, through strikes and got as far as he possibly could right there on a really hot day. So to get get to that point was. Uh, was great, and then you know Cruz gets in a little bit of trouble and just competed like crazy and got out of that spot. And the bullpen really was really good after that. Yeah, um, Cruz <laughs> hasn't been hit. We talked about the other day hasn't hit as much right-handed, but kind of got three hits and just be able to kind of keep things moving. Yeah, he had a great day at the plate on the bases at third base. Um, he's been working really hard on his right-handed swing. You know, working both sides. Um, it can be a lot of maintenance for a switch hitter to, to you know, 
know, it's a lot to think about, but I know that he's really been trying to get locked in right-handed, and today was a big day for him, but we should get him well. You know, Shooter, he might have been kind of vote of confidence yesterday. As a right-handed hitter, he comes out and gets three hits against the left. Yeah. yeah. That's exactly what you were talking about. Yeah, and, and, you know, he's just, like I said, he's been working really hard on it. He knows he can get right-handed, and uh, he's got... Early on, he got most of his at bats left-handed. Right when he, right when he got here, um, so it's, it's just taking a little bit longer to get going right-handed. And, yeah, I mean, I think what he did today will give him a lot of confidence for sure. What did you say about his ability to go from one side of the plate to the other during in the middle of the game and kind of be able to adjust? Really yeah, there, there's definitely advantages to being a switch hitter. Um, you know, if, if, I think if everybody could do it, they would. But um, there is some maintenance to that and. You know, there's the exactly what you said. You get turned around in the middle of a game, and um, you know it can be a, a totally different experience up there. So um, yeah, but he's he's been doing it you know, for a while.